Radio. Let's uh onward I guess. Let's um if his head can be upgraded. Um Oh you can. Increased damage. Hmm, that would never be used. Well I'll never be upgrading it anytime soon. Isn't really I wouldn't use it in combat. It kinda stops you from running. I got five thousand, I need eight to get the next one. Okay. Let's have a look, what does it do? Head of Helios. Um solar flash. Solar flare. <laughs> Easy T reference. Okay. And the head is equipped L2 to shine. Reveals hidden secrets. Um, release bursts of blinding light that briefly stuns enemies and illuminates your surroundings. And hold and release to charge a burst of blinding light. So, solar flash is so well. Solar flare is a bigger version of solar flash. Oh, it's like someone turned the sun on. Right. So, oh, okay, I get it. It counts as an item, doesn't it? Fuck your scaffolding. Yeah. Don't know if to get that chest now. Probably not. I accidentally used some magic um, when I put my controller down after saving. <laughs> I do like the satisfying thud in this game when you hit an enemy. Okay. Pretty sure you get like chests that are hidden. Bastards! Leave me alone, you. This is not helping, man. I can't. Can't see. So much damage these are, these are going to kill me. Because I can't bloody see. Left me alone now, you, you bastards. How oh, were well, you not dead? This stuff now, you. You winged freak shows. Fucking hell. I mean, the fucking the head's useless. You can't use it in combat. Where did that chest go? Tell ya, I can fight centaurs, fucking chimeras, and everything without having too much damage done. But as soon as it comes to flying enemies in this game, fucking hell, they put so many at you, then they just do so much chip damage. Bloody annoying, frustrating little shit. This may be the worst part in the game this, that I can remember. Here. 
You clip through that wall, you bastard. Oh, God. Okay. Give the gun. Get off this bloody rope. Come on. Oh. Why have they still got rope sections in a God of War game? It didn't work for the first two games. I hated it in the first two games. And they still got it in this fucking one. You know what? Oops. Uh. I want to see if it does more damage, like a lot more damage. I wonder if that was a dead end down there. Probably. Yeah, I better not just jump down there, that's stupid. I'm tempted just to fall off and see what happens, but. Oh, but that eerie music is creepy. Kratos! It's getting close! I told you, I cannot help you. But you're the only one who can. I know it. Ready, um, such a salty bastard, isn't he? I mean, yeah, we get it, you're full of rage and everything, but I, I, a little girl is asking for your help, you miserable prick. Oh. Anything around here? Hmm. Come here, you. Wait a minute, was there something to my left? Oh, bollocks. Sorry, I need to, I need, I need to kill myself. No, let, let, let me let, let me kill myself. Oh, you fucking invisible wall bastard. Never mind. It's like I'm not going down there. There must be something down here, though, surely. Yeah. I'll tell you, why I see a torch below me if there's a, an abyss? Oh, is that it? Okay. I guess it's better than nothing. Oh, I think I've got this weird feeling that I hate this section of the game. Maybe because of them? Come here, you. <laughs> oh, so you can grab them out the ground using that. Okay. Holy shit. Camera's not helping.
Uh, oh, it's such a funny... It feels so cheaty. Like, because you can fire it as quick as you can tap. See? <laughs> it's, it's so great. Ah, uh, there's a... Uh, there's gonna be... Some bad guys on their bridges. There's explosive barrels. And there's a health chest and a magic chest. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. Do this. Remember, you have to hold... I have to hold my charge button to use fire. Off you go. Can I? Can I throw them up? I wonder. Check. Why don't you go away? Count. I didn't get any orbs. Oh no, it did. There we go then. You could just you could just charge them off. Huh? It's a bit cheaty. Works for me. Come on, open the chest, you bold twat. Jesus. Jesus. All right. That was a lot easier than I remember it being. Funny how you can cheese a lot of enemies in this game. You don't, I don't remember being able to, uh, well, I don't remember having the knowledge when I played this game originally. Yeah, don't double jump. <laughs> if you double jump, it shoots you into the sky, and I think it triggers a, a, a non... I don't, I don't think you can get out of it. So if you double jump then, I'm pretty sure you'd miss that chest, I think. I think that's it. Now, I'm going to save here, because I think this next part is, um, you have to avoid shit falling down. I'm pretty sure you do. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's take a pause. So, give me one sec. Radio, let's do this. Come on with the wind. Chain of balance. This is a long chain. It goes all the way from Olympus, doesn't it? All the way to... Oh, I don't remember you could dash. I wonder if... Huh. I know hitting these uh, will do a tremendous amount of damage. So... Let's try and not hit them. Holy shit. It's really hard to see because his wings are in the way. Crap. Yeah. Come on now, who's... There's only one guy who's on fire outside and that's that fucking titan who's squishily us. Hey, yeah, mate. Oh, dude, what the hell is your problem? Now you're gonna fucking die. See you, mate. What a fucking badass. In the midst of flying up a chain, he, he still has the time to just pause for a second, stab a titan in the eye, and then murder him. My hands are really sweaty for some reason. That's nervous sweats. But yeah, that, um, I'm guessing that Titan's pissed off because we potentially killed Gaia. Maybe he's salty about it. And he wants to uh, he wants to get in on the Kratos dying action. Did a shit job at it, didn't he? You know, seeing as he instantly just got murdered. 
It's quite funny. Bollocks, is he still alive? Someone's pooping out fireballs. This platform is um, crumble away as well. Whoa! Oh, this isn't dangerous. <laughs> this is quite intense. Come on, quicker. There we go. Woo! So, look, this is glowing in that weird little. It reminds me of the. Um, the chest in God of War 2 where you had to use the, um, the Sisters of Fate's green amulet to go back in time and make chest appear. Oh, yeah. yeah, so I'm guessing that Titan, I'm pretty sure you don't fight him. Being stabbed in the eye with the Blade of Olympus should have either killed him or knocked him off the mountain, so probably won't see him again. Oh, we've gotten faster. So, if I remember correctly, this chain should bring us out at the start of the game. You know where we killed Poseidon? Dude, that is a... Incredibly tight hole. Tee -hee. I don't believe I actually hit something as well. Shit. Oh, you bastard. That chip just tipped the edge of my wings. Oh, well. I don't believe I got hit twice at the end. Shit. I was doing so good. So... Oh no, it didn't put us where I thought it was. I think again the chain goes still goes up, doesn't it? The caverns. The weird box puzzle. Wait, what the fuck am I now? Another Minotaur on. Okay. Right. I know you do a lot of battles on these weird boxes that I don't understand the point of. It's like a massive Rubik's Cube. <laughs> I do like how you can move. But it's, it's like an interactive cutscene. Okay then. Bye. Oh, <laughs> oh shit, I almost jumped off. Wait for it. Yo. Guess we'll just keep doing this until 
we form a box. That was, that's definitely sounds like fighty music. Oh yeah. Tear these guys apart. <laughs> it's like one of the best additions is the charge and throw. Makes killing fodder incredibly funny. What the? Oh, I was pressing the wrong button then. Oh, these are different ones, that's why. So it's a spinning of the analog stick and then a press of a button. I was, I was ramming circle because I thought they were the original ones. These dudes have got armor on. I don't know why they need armor. Oh. Camera angle wasn't helpful. Whee! Off you go. I'm guessing if they smash this chain, I will die. Actually spawned um, like multiple um, enemies. I didn't. I didn't realize it could do that. What the hell? Gonna use my magic for a bit. Me a bully. Fuck off. There we go. Jump on its back. Ride him like a pony. So much damage is he does so much damage. There we go. So hectic. I do like when they hit the wall, they do that little smashing into the wall and they get stunned for a while. It does make uh, managing big enemies a lot easier where they're not just walking through your attacks. Damn, that was hectic. <laughs> that was fucking great. Oh, look. That should be Hermes. He's a right twat. I hate him. 
It's one of the worst people in the game. <laughs> Look who it is. Rachel, the ghost of Sparta. The fallen god. The cursed mortal. To get a flock from the ass of Zeus. Uh -huh. It's not worth my time. A coward's words, Kratos. You don't try to catch me because you know you can't. Kratos! Where are you off to today? <laughs> kill any family members lately? Oh, that's right. You're off to kill your father, Zeus. <laughs> Won't happen, can't happen. Kratos is on a fool's errand. Again. Never, never learn. Never, never change. Kratos, the fool who killed his own blood. Kratos the fool among mortals and gods, forever, ever cursed, forever, ever doomed, consumed by Veriginus to his last breath. The Spartan lights the way to dusty death. <laughs> A prick. Of course he has to be shitty British, because that's what all British people sound like. Do I sound like that? Hells no, I don't. I'd sew his fucking mouth shut if he spoke to me like that. Yeah, I don't know why he's given such a... a and again, I guess you give him a cocky accent so people hate him. Which it instantly works because I hate him. He's a, he's a terrible he's a terrible character. And like he's talking like um, creators can't kill Zeus. Dude, he's killed like three gods already. Killing Zeus is no different. You know? Kratos has the ability to kill a god, so... A little quick time. Uh, oh no, it's not. I thought it was like uh, just a, a cutscene. Here we go. This is where we started originally. There's the um, the the eagles. We went there and we read it. I was like, that's a big chain. I think this is just before you fight Poseidon. Then you, I think you go around and you end up in um, the tomb of Ares, and then you fight your first centaur. This is a big chain. <laughs> Ooh. I'd be... I'd be fucking knackered. Flame of Olympus. Hidden away. Do not deceive you, Kratos. It is the same box you opened years ago. The power to kill a god to kill Rex's god. I released those powers when I killed Ares. No. Trapped inside that box, there is a stronger power. It has been missing from the world. It all began when Zeus triumphed over the Titans in the Great War. Understood that the evils born from that battle, if left free, would destroy the world of man and God. To contain these evils, Zeus commissioned Hephaestus to build a vessel strong enough to hold them. Fear. Greed. Hate. He locked them all away in a box in hopes that they would never again infect his reign. When you opened the box to kill Ares, you drew from the forbidden power. After witnessing your victory, fear gripped Zeus. But the flame is deadly. How can I recover the box? With its namesake, Kratos. Pandora? She is the key to the destroying the flame, the key to our revenge. This will be difficult, Sergeant. A simple child will not trouble me, Athena. I hope you are right, good Sparta. Huh, what she said then? Our, our revenge. 
Why does Athena want revenge? Uh, why does Athena want revenge? He died protecting Zeus. Why would she want to kill him? Yeah, that is definitely not Athena. Not the Athena we know, anyway. That's something impersonating Athena. Seeing as if she's the only one that Kratos would really trust. You know, he doesn't have a lot of friends and... You know. But yeah, she's the same... Um, she has the same form as a, uh, a primordial does. If you if you look for the primordials in, um, on one of the Wikipedia pages or something, they're almost the same. They're like translucent ghosts. But they have that weird green or blue or purple shimmer to them. So yeah, methinks somebody's impersonating Athena to kill the gods for some for some reason. Still not sure. I, I, I again, as as of this point in time, um, we still don't know who or what Athena or who Athena is. So hopefully, um, if the well, I'm guessing they will make another God of War game. Hopefully, and it should cover a bit more because that's what I'm more interested in. I mean, the comic for the for the, the Fallen God comic still not come out, so but I don't think that will tell you who or what Athena is. Hopefully, hopefully it's not just something they've just decided to gloss over, and hope, hopefully people forget about it. Cause you know, I like Athena. It's stupid that they decided to kill her off. So that's the way out. But yeah, when I, when she was talking about um, the fear and shit being put in a box, if that's true, uh, how come humans still experienced it? Like fear and um, hate and stuff. The world is not perfect. The world's far from perfect, even in God of War. Even before the Pandora's box was open, fear and shit like that it still affected people. Unless it was just for the gods, you know take fear away from somebody and they just become stupid don't they uh, can I oh I can use the this here uh, there we go this should tell us a bit of a background story give it a look come on Jesus Christ I think it doesn't do that for all of them have a look. Flame of Olympus. Death awaits all those who touch the flame, god or mortal. Yet even this power pales against that which is protected in its core. It's weird. So they're saying that Pandora's box is more powerful than a flame that can kill a god. Mm. Mm. I guess in, in a sense, fear and hate can easily corrupt. Make gods do stupid things. Such as what they're doing now. But yeah, because Zeus feared Kratos, didn't he? Probably why he decided to smash up Hephaestus to take his anger out on somebody. And again, why did Hephaestus create Pandora? Surely it wasn't. Surely her existence is just to get. just to withstand the, the, flame, the flame of Olympus. Why would he need that? You know? Unless he was. Batting for the other side. Uh, balance of power. Uh, the muses guide souls in life, the three judges in death, and then they run between them. The key to the flame guides the balance of power. That's that box room we was just in. Above that is obviously Olympus. And that's, the, uh, that's where those three judges were that we saw in the beginning of the game. They had those weird crystals in the back of their head and they were like... Roar. But we've seen the muses. We've seen the judges. But the room between them is the key to the flame that guides Olympus. The key is the flame. The key to the flame guides... That's so weird to read. The muses guide the souls, judges could be in death, and in the room between them, the key to the flame. Balance of power. What's the key to the flame? Well, if the key to the flame is Pandora, the Pandora guides the balance of... That can't be right. That's, uh, <laughs> that's too much on my brain. Judges of Hades. In the judges' hands, the fate of Olympus lies. 
but is they who control the great chain and determine its release. That's not exactly true. Uh, later on in the game, you find out that that's just a lot of bollocks. They're basically just statues doing what they're been made to do. Oh. You may have brute force, but you lack speed. All right, spider twat. Oh, <laughs> you bastard! Oh, dude, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut you so hard. We've got more pictures to look at, so get off your high horse, you speed little shit. What else we got here? Did we get the last one over here? Or was. Yeah. So, what's this one? The Muses. Have we seen the Muses? I don't think we. Were they in the, th in the first game, the Muses? There's, there's golden statues of the muses you had to pick up to open a door, I think. No! No, 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 they are in this game. I remember the music thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. It'll make sense. In the music untold... In music untold truths bespoke to those willing to hear it. Why is... Why is everything written in, in a sense that it's just one long word? In music untold, truth be spoke to those willing to hear it. But there should be a comma in that sentence somewhere. Huh. Uh, join your voice to the muse's song and lift Olympus' burden. I ain't singing. Hell no. Gear of burden. Uh, with the weight of Olympus upon it, the gear of burden is not easily moved, requiring a great sacrifice to free the heart of the uh, heart of the Leviathan. Labyrinth. That's a great sacrifice. Okay. These are basically spoiling the game, <laughs> which is quite funny. The heart of the oh, there you go. That's Pandora. Heart of the Le Heart of the Leviathan uh, Labyrinth. I don't know why I keep seeing the Leviathan. Weird. Uh, beaten in the heart of the Labyrinth is a passion great enough to douse even the flames of Olympus, and lay bare the power that lies within. That's obviously Pandora. Look at it. Same fucking shape of the statues that we keep seeing. Anyway, uh, some of the locations we I think we'll be visiting them. I can't remember now. I'm going to say yes, because we've been to all these. Anyway, before we chase after shit back there, uh, let's take a save. So yeah, one sec. <laughs> 